Oh, wow. That's super interesting. Oh, hey. Didn't see you there. <laughs> we like to have fun here. But today, we're going to talk about something that's no laughing matter. We're going to talk about the consequences of drinking pond water and why you shouldn't do it. Keep in mind I am wearing a lab coat so you know I'm credible. Look, I get it. When you're at a party and the cool kid hands you a red solo cup filled to the brim with sweet, sweet pond water, it's really hard to say no. Today, we're going to show you why you should just say no to drinking pond water. When you look through the world of a microscope, you gain perspective. An innocent drop of water can quickly become a microbe-infested plethora of organisms. As you can see, there is an abundance of life and organisms here. Let's take a look at a few of them in particular. This banana-looking creature doing sit-ups is called Lepancilius fuchsia. I definitely did not pronounce that correctly. Look at this fella go. This frisbee-looking creature is called a fascist. Like many microbes, it is a photosynthetic organism which means I get to show this illustration of photosynthesis. Photosynthesis! Photosynthesis! This watermelon-esque thing is another variation of Lepincilius. This sand dollar looking organism is called Pandarina sp. It is made up of a cluster of small balls of algae. These balls are very unsanitary, just like the balls at the Chuck E. Cheese ball pit. This twisted tadpole creature is another variety of fascist sp. As you can see, it is being pushed around by other microorganisms. That is bullying. Bullying of any size isn't cool, which is why you should never drink pond water or peer pressure anyone into drinking it. Also, if you do drink pond water, you'll get very sick, just like if you go in a Chuck E. Cheese ball pit. What a tasty cup of joe. Hi again. We had a lot of fun here today. Luckily for everyone, there is not an epidemic of at-risk youth drinking pond water, nor an epidemic of parents going through midlife crises trying to emulate the cool youth by drinking pond water. There is, however, a more serious issue. Only a small percentage of you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. If you bother to watch this video to the end and see me talking, you might as well hit subscribe, like this video, and hit the bell button so you don't miss out on future content. It's totally radical! All the cool kids are doing it, why not you? 